A prime number is a positive integer that is divisible only by itself and one. Around 300 BC, Euclid proved there were an infinite number of prime numbers. But how frequently do prime numbers occur? How common are they? To quantify this, let's define a function pi of n to give the number of primes less than or equal to n. This function has nothing to do with the number pi. This is just the traditional name for the function. Here are some examples. Pi of 6 equals 3 because the prime numbers less than or equal to 6 are 2, 3, and 5. Pi of 10 equals 4 because the only primes less than or equal to 10 are 2, 3, 5, and 7. And here is a plot of the first 1,000 values of pi of n. The prime number theorem says that pi of x is asymptotically equivalent to x over log x. As a reminder, two sequences a sub n and b sub n are asymptotically equivalent if the limit as n goes to infinity of a sub n over b sub n is 1. Another way to interpret the prime number theorem is that of the first n integers, roughly 1 over log n of them will be prime. The prime number theorem was independently conjectured by Gauss and Legendre in the late 1700s, but it took the work of many mathematicians another hundred years before it was independently proven to be true by Hadamard and de la Vallée-Pousson in 1896.